Yeah, so the next part, the next little segment I want to get to, because I'm not going to lie, I realize how long I'm talking about 18 teams each would be, shocker. But what I've done is something that I'm sure is on your mind, as a mind of any other football fan, is what if the MLS was seven teams instead of 32? I mean, the MLS kind of has some weird rules, and they always have expansion teams, so I wouldn't rule it out. But basically what I've done is I have taken all 32 MLS teams, and I've divided them by region. So I took the Canadian teams, I took the Western teams, I took the Midwestern teams, the team is Texas, I think kind of get the point. And what I did is I looked at all the transfer market pages extensively, and I found the most valuable lineup. So basically, we're going to go through, I'm going to read them off, that's that's really it, we're going to react to them. So... I named each team. I took a little bit of bit of creative foreground, and I mm-hmm. named them all after defunct North American Soccer League clubs. Before the MLS, the days of the MLS was the North American Soccer League, which is since defunct. Um, but I, I kind of brought, brought a bit of homage to that, and I named all these teams after those. So, um, there's, there's something called a sympathy selection, which basically means some teams, um, cough cough, Colorado Rapids, were so shit that. None of their teams, their players would have made it if it weren't for a special exception. So, yeah, uh, there's like two in the whole experience. So, the first team is Canadian Blizzard. This consists of the, play, the most valuable players from Vancouver, Montreal, and Toronto. At goalie, we got Yohi Takooka. I probably didn't say that right. Vancouver Whitecaps, 1.5 million euros. We got Joel Waterman from CF Montreal in the back line. Then he's joining Vancouver's Tristan Blackman. Ruan from CF Montreal and Sam Addy Kukbe from Vancouver Whitecaps. We got an all Vancouver midfield of Ryan Gold, Andres Kubas, and Pedro Vite. Uh, an Italian Toronto front line of Lorenzo Insigne and Federico Brandeschi. All these players are still in this, these clubs when I um when, when I did it. That team equates to 38.3 million euros, which is the same market value as Abraham Akanate. Next up, we got Great Plains Tornadoes. This is players from Salt Lake, Colorado, Kansas City, St. Louis, and Minnesota. We got Rowan Berkey in goal from St. Louis, Joachim Nielsen, Justin Glad, Logan N- Ndengbe, Andres Maxo, he's the one sympathy selection, Emmanuel Reynoso, Edward Lowen, Diego Luna, Kristen Arango, Bongo Kule, Hogwane, The Goat, and then Daniel Saloy from Kansas City. Uh, they are worth 43.2 million euros, which is the same market value as Joel Linton. Next up, we've got the Texas Roughnecks, That's by crazy. far the most fun team in this experiment. I don't know. I made this like a month ago. So this is teams from Dallas, Austin, <laughs> Houston. We've got Martin Pius from FC Dallas, Leo Weissenen, Marcos Farfan, Julio Cascante, John Gallagher, the GOAT in midfield with Sebastian Druisi, the bastard himself. Then we've got Alberto Carzquia from Houston Dynamo, and then Paxton Palmicall in the midfield. Uh, front line of Jesus Freya, Alan Velasco, and Sebastian Ferreira. We got we got two Ferreiras in the in the front line. How about that? Uh, they're the same value is of fifty point two mil, which equals Matthias Tell's current transfer value. So that's nice. Next up, we got the Midwest. Matthias Tell from Bayer. Yes. So that whole squad is with Matthias Tell. Next up, we got the Damn. Midwest Mustangs: Patrick Schulte, Miles Robinson, Malte Amundsen, Carlos Teran, Math Miaza, Louis. Luciano Acosta, Brian Gutierrez, Federico Navarro, Cucho Hernandez, the Cremo go himself, Diego Rossi, and Aaron Bupenza from FC Cincinnati. That is players from Chicago, Columbus, and Cincinnati. Northeast Cosmos. This team, I'm surprised. Oh, that that team was worth as much as um as Kai Havertz, 54, 54.8. I'm surprised oh. this team was so high. Northeast Cosmos. This is kind of, kind of a weird team. Teams from players from New England. The two New York teams, Philadelphia and D.C. We've got Tyler Miller for D.C. United mm-hmm. coming in at 600k, the one sympathy selection. Then we've got Kai Wagner, Dejoan Jones, John Tolkien, Brandon Bai, Daniel Gazdag, Carlos Gill, Nicolas Acevedo, Talis Magno, Julian Carranza, and Thiago Andrade. They were with 56.1, which is the same transfer value as Usman Dembele. Not bad. West Coast Surf. This is mm-hmm. probably the most competent team on the list. We've got Maxime Cripo, Kamal Miller, Nuhu, Yamar Gomez, Julian Aude, Ricky Peague, Evander, Jackson Huel, Dennis Bronga, Jordan Morris, and Stipe Buke. They were at 65.5 mil, which is the same value as Mohamed Salah. Which, uh, which, which region was this? This is West Coast Surf. This is players from Seattle, oh, okay. Portland, San Jose, LA Galaxy, and LAFC. The final one, you guessed it, it's the most valuable. The Southeastern Strikers. We got players I was gonna from, say. from Nashville, Charlotte, Atlanta, Orlando. 
and Miami. We got Christian Kalina from Charlotte in goal for 1.5 million euros. Thomas Avilis from Miami. Caleb Viley from Atlanta United. Walker Zimmerman, the GOAT from Nashville. And Jordi Alba from Inter Miami. A midfield of Tiago Almada from Atlanta. Hani Mukhtar from Nashville. And Facundo Farias from Inter Miami. Up top, we got the goal, Lionel Messi at 35 mil, Facundo Torres from Orlando for 14, and Carl Swizer Dick from Charlotte for 6 mil. This is worth 116 and a half million, it's the same price as Buki Osaka, compared to the other 65, it, it, it's kind of wild, but yeah, I know that was, that was a lot. So wait, kind of... did you include Almada, Tiago Almada? I'm yeah. sure you did, right? Yeah, so it's funny, because it's based off... But you Almada didn't include Giacomacchus. So, there, so there's no Suarez, there's no um, Busquets, because it's purely off market value, and they're not really valuable, but obviously Messi still is, but yeah, I know that was a bit wow. rapid fire, my, my bad, but um, yeah, so th no, I, 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 I thought it was kind of fun. Um, mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so there you go. So if the MLS ever goes bankrupt and they can only have seven teams, I did your work for you. So cheers to that. But um, yeah, I think you're out of here. Uh, <laughs> I think that's a good place to leave it. How about you? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, no, it was this was this was fun. I'd be happy to come back. Yeah, no, another of course. Guest. We, we always need we always need people over here in the state of Florida. And it was a pleasure to have you, even though you support United. So um, yeah, cheers <laughs> for coming on, and we'll see all of you, all nine of you listeners, next time.